I didn't write this, but someone wants my Sam. <laughs> Probably one of the best looking churches I've ever seen in all my years of travel. <laughs> oh. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are in Busan. We're going to be exploring some of the amazing sites and taking you guys along with us. So we're currently staying in Siomyong, which is really far from our first spot of the day. We're heading to Heiyong, Heidong, Yongguksa Temple. Honestly, guys, the words here are so hard. It's going to be pronounce. the theme of the vlog today. <laughs> but yeah, we have to take a bus, and it's going to take an hour and a half. I hope that means I've got that, but it's upside down. <laughs> oh yeah, it is upside down. Look. So I've got that on there. There we go, then here's our bus. Thank you. So something you should be aware of in Korea is that the seats at the very front of the bus are for the elderly and the seats at the back are for the younger generation. Colour-coded. Yeah, so yellow. yellow is for elderly. Pink for pregnant. Yeah. Pretty cute. It's really nice. And no, normally no one actually sits on them, whereas in England everyone just sits down. <laughs> they don't care. In England there's no respect. So after an hour we are at our first spot of the day. Oh. And this is called... <laughs> oh, hour is on that bus. I'm so tired, I need coffee. Come on, please can we find the coffee? <laughs> so excited, I need this coffee so bad, look at my eyes. We got up at six o'clock this morning and I was so not ready to get up. I wanted to just lay there like, <laughs> but instead the alarm kept going. Now, yeah, that good. Hello. This coffee is so good, and the coffee in Korea is just everyone we've had in it has been literally insane. Thank you. Bye bye, thank you. Oh my god, it was so cute. It was like that big. I bet it costs so much because we saw a normal watermelon the other day and it was like 23 pounds, which is like 25. US dollars, how insane for one melon. So all the statues have different heads. Wow. Are regarded as the origin of Oriental philosophy and the ultimate truth of the universe. So you got a rat, you got an ox, tiger, rabbit, dragon, snake, horse, ram, monkey, rooster, dog, all right. Do, are you and pig. We actually checked our zodiac signs online and Rhea is a fire rat and I'm a wood dog. Fire rat. <laughs> wood dog. So this temple is actually free, which is good. And it's meant to be the most beautiful temple in Korea. So we shall see. <laughs> I wish I and Sam always happy, healthy, everything lucky. I didn't write this, but someone wants my Sam. <laughs> so I'm thinking I might move to Korea because I've just been called handsome for like the 10th time. It's because you are handsome. <laughs> in England, not so much, but in Korea, yes. As you can see, the weather's a bit moody today, but coming from Seoul, it was like 30 degrees, pure sun, and actually this is better, because it was too hot. 
Monday. I'm so glad it's cloudy because I've made a very rookie error today and come out and forgot to put deodorant on for the first time literally ever whilst traveling. So I'm really worried. <laughs> and they don't sell deodorant in Korea. Like I've looked in a few shops. Hopefully I can find some. Otherwise I might get a bit uh, smelly. <laughs> Oh, oh, thank you. Where did you come from? England. England. Yeah. England. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay, enjoy your day. Bye. Bye. Nice to meet We've explored the temple. We've been here for about an hour and a half, I think. Time has flown. Yeah, it's absolutely stunning. beautiful. It's absolutely stunning. Yeah, like highly recommend you come yeah. on your trip to Busan. It's so unusual because it's by the ocean mm. and you can hear like the waves as well as the chanting. Mm. And yeah, it's just absolutely stunning. Really, really loved it actually. <laughs> now we are on our way to our next spot which is Gamchong Culture Village. We've seen some pictures of it online and it looks really cute. We were going to check out the beach, which is close by to this temple, but the weather is the right weather really cloudy yeah. and actually we don't have a lot of time. So we've decided to skip that. But the beach close by, Hyundai Beach, does look really beautiful and it's usually a must do on people's Busan itinerary, but in the clouds, meh. We've seen yeah. a lot of beaches, so we can yeah. skip this one. <laughs> Oh, get yourself a boyfriend that pushes you up heels. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh. We arrived at half nine and it was kind of busy, but not that busy. But now it's no. nearly 11 and it's absolutely packed. Yeah, so, so get here early. Yeah, get here early because it um, takes away the magic when it's crowded, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, deja vu right now. It's sad to be done. Oh. <laughs> so we've just got another bus to the next spot, which I'm not going to try and pronounce, but rear seat literally goes back. <laughs> I sat down and thought I was going to fall through the back of the bus. Oh, comfy though, rocks. Oh, it is so humid today. So getting on this bus was amazing because the aircon just hits you. Oh, it feels so good. But I think we're going to be on here for about an hour and a half to the next spot. So we'll see you there. So after two and a half hours, we've made it to Gamcheon Culture Village. Yeah, we got a little bit lost. Well, it wasn't yeah. our fault. The it bus went the wrong way. Our fault. Normally it's our fault, but this time it wasn't. The bus went the wrong way. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. And then, um, and then we stopped in a baguette shop and got some bread. So yeah. Very so interesting. We're here, we're here now, and now we're going to explore a little bit. I can already see some cute shops. <laughs> No. Can't see a pattern? I see someone fishing. <laughs> Can you? No. Someone yeah, fishing. it's someone fishing. Yeah. But... <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> According to Google, this is known as the Machu Picchu of Korea. Because all the colourful houses up the mountains. It used to be the slums, apparently, but now it's been regenerated and is now a massive tourist destination. But it really reminds us of England. <laughs> I don't know why. I think it's because there's like a fish and chip shop, which yeah. is very random With for Korea. a British Korea. flag on it. Yeah. <laughs> Frozen beer. Oh my gosh. Should we get one? Yes. Oh, oh, oh so it's got to be done, innit? Yeah? Let's get one. Alright. Yeah. Thank mm. you. Mm. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's like, it's like the froth of beer, but like with a... 
Mm. Really good. It's really good. You know. You know. Probably one of the best looking churches I've ever seen in all my years of travel. <laughs> Truly breathtaking. The architecture is on point. <laughs> So this is 7,000 and I've been looking for a headband for a very long time, literally months, so I think I'm going to have to get it. They actually discuss me how much Rhea suits hats compared to me. I never wear them though. I look like so stupid with a hat on, but Rhea, every hat she tries on looks unreal. Right, let's give it a test. What about this one? <laughs> so I found these little earrings with the ball back. And they're normally really expensive, but they're literally like 3,000 and they go up here or like in your lip. So I think I'm gonna have to get that as well. This is why we don't come in jewelry shops. So what do you think? Yeah, I really like it. There's loads of like cute little coffee shops and shops and <laughs> boutiques and all that stuff. And more shops. And more shops, yeah. Not so much for Sam, it's very girly. <laughs> <laughs> We just went into a shop to get some deodorant for Ria, and Ria was like, it's so hot. And the guy went behind the counter and got us some like cold drinking water. So kind. So nice. That would never happen in London. No. It's just crazy. And like, people did. are so nice here. And if it did. And if it did. You'd think that they were drugging you. <laughs> Hello. 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 You're such an exaggerator. <laughs> so after walking around for about three hours, there, yeah. we've decided to get a beer. Because yeah. the frozen beer was nice, but it just didn't do it. It was oh. more froth than beer. Yeah, and we saw this place and it looked cute. And as you know, I love a good bit of cute. And uh, the That's like your catchphrase. Yeah, it is. It actually is. And then the air con was blowing out. Was, oh, wow, look at that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, cheers. I think we're going to get one more and then we're going to go and get some street food <laughs> and if you watched our last vlog you see how that went down not so well <laughs> By the way, we don't drink all the time. It's just that we only vlog once a week, pretty much, and that's when we decide to have a beer. Wow, show them. So I asked them what this was. I thought it was milk, <laughs> but it's alcohol, and they've given us a little glass. Thank you. Hands up, me down. Thank you. Cheers, Thank mother. You. I don't know if you down it or not. Mm. That was good. I'm honestly unsure of how he's drinking a whole bottle of that. Yeah. It's so strong. It's almost strong. like tequila. Yeah. And he's drinking like the whole bottle. It's good. Thank you. Thank you. I've got mosquito bites sitting here. Can you believe it? Um, yeah, so they give us this. I don't know what it is. I thought it was melon, but <laughs> it's not. It's something fermented. Cucumber? Radish? Um. Might be radish. Fermented radish, maybe. If you're Korean and you know what it is, please let us know in the comments because we are eating blindly. Really good though. I think it might be radish. Mm. So we just met these lovely guys and we were trying to get them to sub to our YouTube but it's all in a Korean keyboard but we finally figured it out. So now you on YouTube with us. You do you now YouTube. Yes. 
<laughs> so after four hours of chilling with the locals, eating the best food that we've had in Korea, we're now going to take the bus back to our place. And it should take about an hour and a half. Yeah, if we can find the way. We wasn't supposed to stay that long. We've no. just come in for one beer, but then everyone kept talking to us and then we had like, a really good time. And it was such a vibe. Something we love about traveling is when you come off of the tourist path. Yes, get lost. Get lost completely and you meet the locals and everyone keeps talking to you and it really does feel like traveling. It really so, does. We are going to try and make our way back somehow. Yes. So we're going to end the vlog here, guys. We really, really appreciate if you've lasted this long in the video. We're going to see you in Japan. <laughs> Be sure to like, subscribe and comment on the video if you liked it. See you in the next one. <laughs> Is it still working? Are they still there? <laughs>